Oh, that says vegan fool. I'm in vegan food. What's up everybody, it's Timothy here. Welcome to my channel and if you've been here before, Thanks for coming back. So my first trick is to turn a live picture into a boomerang. So what you're gonna do for this one is open up your camera app, take, make sure that your live mode is on, and then take a picture off it, off whatever you're taking a picture off. Then you go over to your Instagram, swipe up, hit, and you can see I did that quite a few times. And now it's just gonna show up as a normal picture till you hold down on it and then it'll turn it into a boomerang. Hey, why is mine not working? I promise you this works. Oh, there we go. Now it's working. So, turn a live picture into a boomerang. So if you're one of those people that have left live mode on while you've been taking pictures, you can just go back and turn those memories into boomerangs. Tip number two is to crop your images before you post them to Instagram so that Instagram does not compress them when they do it for you. Select the picture, edit it, hit that crop ratio. You can go down here to select what ratio you want. Nine by 16 is the Instagram crop. So you just line that up. And I'm gonna pick that because I like the leaf peeking in the corner. Hit okay. And now you have an image that covers the entire screen from top to bottom. Tip number three is an easy way to create collages on your Instagram story. Now all you have to do is open up Instagram. You already have a picture selected. Go to your photo album. Now since we posted this dish of vegan food, let's go to another picture of vegan food. You can probably tell I'm not the biggest fan of vegan food. Hit that little button in the bottom and hit copy. Now when you go back to Instagram, Instagram will pop up and say add sticker. Click add sticker and now you can just move that around. And if you so desire, you could even pinch the background image and make that a little smaller Make this a little bigger. And you can you can arrange it however you want. I'm just gonna keep this full, full size, and then I'm gonna create a little image on the inside. You can put as many images as you want. You can put one, maybe I'll put another one. So let's go back, let's choose, let's choose this one. Copy, add sticker, and now we've got now we've got a collage. Tip number four is adding rainbow text to your story. All right, so we already have our collage set. So let's, let's type vegan food. Okay, now I like to add shadows to my text, so I'm gonna just make it black. Sometimes, actually, sometimes even a really dark gray is better. So I'm gonna center that. Oop. I'm gonna copy the text. I'm gonna paste the text again, and I'm gonna go select all. Now once you've selected all of it, you're gonna hold down with this thumb on the right or left side of that select all text, and with the other thumb, you're gonna hold down on a color and drag across, and as you drag across, you're gonna move your other thumb with it. And we're gonna paste vegan food, come down, line it up to how you want it, select all, hold down with one thumb, select the color you want with the other, and then in sync, move down, there we go. So, because of the greens in the background, I'm gonna change this to black so it's a little more readable. And that's that's why you use shadows, when the shadows will bring out your texts. That's, that's a bonus tip. Use shadow double texts so you people can read it better. And lastly, tip number five has nothing to do with the Instagram app or external apps or any software with your phone. It has to do with an accessory. Now this is an attachable wide angle lens for your phone. I got this for about $12 on Amazon, I think. I'll link it in the description below. But you could get better quality lenses for a moment and it, there's one other company, the name's slipping my mind at the moment, but I will link both of them below as well. But this, this works perfectly well too. I will say, however, the biggest downfall of buying cheap glass like this or a cheap wide angle lens for your phone like this is that the, the glass scratches extremely easily. So 
you could invest in a hundred dollar moment lens or in a case or get a 12 to 15 dollar attachable lens like this and take really really good care of it so this is how it works you're going to open up your instagram app that's what it looks like straight out of the camera when you put one of these on it just makes everything so much wider so much nicer like just the amount that you can get in frame just by putting one of these on, it's amazing. I do a lot, a lot of my stories with one of these on, especially when I'm trying to do a selfie. So this one, okay, let's turn this around. So this is what it looks like straight out of camera. And this is what it looks like with the lens on. And I usually do a lot of my stories like this so that I can show off the backdrop, I can show off where I am. It's, if I'm out in the city, oh, and you can see <laughs> the lighting setup. But this is essentially why I think this is tip number five and why everybody needs to invest in some sort of external lenses for their phones because it just levels up. It just levels all of it up. Well, those are my top five tips and tricks you probably didn't know you could use to hack your Instagram stories. Level them up. Make your friends wonder how the hell you're doing it, all the while it's making them jealous because your stories are now better than theirs. That is it for me, peeps. If you enjoyed this video, do not forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Smash that like button and turn on your post notification button for future videos. Okay, I'm gonna go. <laughs>